is the main event. Well, I'm assuming. I don't know. We still have like five to go after this, but it is the main event for now. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the channel. My name is Jack the Bus, and it is Thorfinn versus Thorkel. It's been a relatively long time coming, but I'm going to be honest. I, I don't know how this ends up. I haven't been able to predict a whole lot of what's going on in Vinland Saga thus far, and I'm guessing it's just going to keep throwing curveballs at me, so we're going to hop into it. Drop a sub if you're new, and let's get started. Dude, I just know these manga panels go crazy. <sighs> They're cheering for Thorfinn. I mean, someone brave enough to take on Thor count on 1v1. Oh, chain mail. Helga's the one from a family home. Thor's was. Hmm. Helga was royal. You gotta beat me. Oh my. Not even beat. Just fight. Helga was royal. Thor's climbed the ranks with his skills. Okay, dude. I'll believe it when I see it. Oh my. Dang, bro. He said you're nothing like Thorfinn. They all shut up real quick. I love this so much. I was going to say, I wonder what Thorkel would think if he found out that Askeladd was technically the one that... Well, he wasn't the one that called it Floki was, but the one that killed Thors. But he would just be like, well, I, I, he, there was a stronger warrior. Like, that's how he sees the world. All right, Thorfinn, lock in, baby. I don't think Thorkel would kill him. I don't. Oh, yeah, wait, true. Wait, wait, true. Wait, true. Where's Canute? He's just lying down? Is Bjorn fighting the other guys? Oh, Bjorn's going crazy. <gasps> I still miss him. Mm -hmm. I'm telling you the truth. This cold world. He genuinely thinks he can't carry on without Ragnar. Can't be strong enough. Oh my gosh! This is wrong! He was literally his father! Raised you as a normal child, and that's the best fa favor he ever did to him. The king wanted just a weapon, a mindless ruler. <laughs> Oh. oh my gosh this is him letting go you only realize yeah i mean it was his mind doing this experiencing this and i really wonder what what's in store for canute in terms of his like character arc yeah i think bjorn's just beating the shit out of the he is right in front of him you don't mess with bjorn on shrooms look at him oh my gosh Dude, i would want to see mushroom bjorn take out thorkel thorkel would win but still <laughs> <laughs> Canute does stand up for himself eventually, too. What is he supposed to do? How does he still have booze? <laughs> Dog! Oh my gosh. He also sees himself as just a pawn. Oh, love! That's been the whole, the whole thing with the priest. True. Actually, they're looting the men. He's just stealing his shoes. Why would you walk away from that duel? Like they're just swinging the axes. I like the two axes versus the two knives. Oh, there's blood on it, dude. There's cuts all over his body. No, I think that's just like, I don't know. He could kill Thorfinn if he wanted to. I genuinely think that. Oh, shoot. Oh, shoot. He's entering final form. Thorfinn's fighting to kill, though, because he actually does want to ask a lad. Or the final blow once I stop him from moving. Gotta cut down the giant. Something missing. <laughs> That's why you're so excited. Time is stopping. 
Huh. What's love? What's a true warrior? There's way too heavy of questions being asked to me right now. Love? Bjorn? Free of sin. And death. This show is way too existential, man. Death perfects a person. It's like the these are overlapping right now. Dang, dude, his one question cut to him. He's not even meaning to get into Thorfinn's head. Just reminded him of his father. Death is the essence of love. Yeah, exactly. What was Ragnar to Canute? Discrimination. I, 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 I don't know. I, maybe I am. I don't know. I'm trying my best. Oh, it's all crystal clear. This show is so pretty, man. It's so unfair. Oh, oh. He's cutting him. Dude. It's a little show, but you're slowly cutting him down. Bit by bit. Dude, Canute is having like revelations. The snow is love. He's sending, is, I think he's saying like anything free of sin is. Anything that completely and utterly offers itself. They're all laid barren. Mm, none whatsoever. The apple. Dude, more, more biblical imagery, I think. Mm. Oh, come on. Oh, the he kick him up? Dude, this episode has me just in trance. Where did he go? How high? Oh, oh, oh no. He kicked him on the football field away, bro. Asquad looks like genuinely concerned. I guess because if uh, if Thorfinn loses, he he goes with <laughs> Thor Thorkel. Oh my gosh, dude! This I I gotta rewatch this like maybe five more times. This was beautiful. <laughs> Bjorn, stop, <laughs> please. Oh wait, there's like knives. Oh my gosh, bro! How long do the mushrooms last? He's lost full. Does Bjorn die? Wait, no. Canute's gonna stand up for himself. The apple, the apple of sin, dude. Something we'll never get back. Perfection? Love? He's scaring Bjorn back! It's like questioning God. Mm hmm. Love. Wow. We will find it. Oh my gosh, man. What is this show? Oh! Oh! Oh my, you can't be serious! Dude, Canute is like a new person. A miracle? What miracle? The fact that he was able to calm Bjorn down? Dude, Canute is taking a stance! To not give him over to Thorkel. Yeah. Meaning. He's like, meaning. What is the meaning to anything? <laughs> gosh. Oh my gosh, he's turning into a leader, bro! He'll determine meaning. Damn! Canute has arrived! Holy! My gosh, man. I, after I finish, however this does end up, this first season, I feel like I'm gonna have to watch it again to really understand. There's so many themes at work, of course, like recurring ones, but it's so just enchanting. I lock in trying to figure out the point they're trying to get across because if I, I feel like if I don't, I'm failing. But I feel like a lot of the stuff that's been covered so far has been interpreted in so many different ways. And finally, can 
Anud has gotten through to an extent what what one purpose of life is and even sort of answered the question of the priest that nobody's been able to this entire time myself included and finally also for the first time in, in a little bit we got something here with Thorfinn that really hit some nail on a head some path for him besides just pure anger towards Askeladd where he thought back to his father and, and it frustrated him because it, he did realize he was caught up in the middle of battle but it did sort of breach some hole in his brain where he's like okay well let's think about this in this way and I'm shocked because the door is probably the last person that I expected to get that out of him yes he knew his father and uh you know they were close to an extent from what we know but the workout doesn't seem like the type of guy to be searching for anything I, I thought he was very pretty much what you see is what you get but clearly I'm wrong he's also searching for something but who isn't in this world it's like uh what was it what Kenny said in Attack on Titan like everybody's got to be drunk on something searching for something hoping to achieve something that's that's how you get through your days but I, uh, dude I just I continue to enjoy Vinland Saga more and more and more and it just makes me think man guys that's been it for my reaction today I hope you did enjoy drop a like on this one if you haven't already and I'll catch you next time is base